Something in my chest that I can't hide When feelings get involved, I'm terrified And a string. You don't understand the pain it brings. You don't ever want to give me one. Hi, guys! Welcome back to my channel. My name is Esfari Chabirita, aka Amy Sweet. Weh, guys! It's when I'm waking, I'm waking up, and I can't even start to tell you what time it is. I've just gone and washed my face and brushed my teeth. And tell me why I'm craving a cold Coca Cola. I think that is what I'm going to have for, for breakfast then because I'm craving that. So, all I want to say is thank you so much for the love you're showing my vlog, guys. If you have not subscribed, what are you waiting for? Please go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Leave comments in my videos. And guys, welcome to Moving Vlog 3. And I'm hoping that this is the third and the last moving vlog because I'm done doing the moving vlogs. My bedroom is in order. My kitchen is somehow in order. And then my living room. And today we are doing my living room because my living room is not livable. Like there's a way I like my living room to look like. And this one doesn't look livable. So I'm going to show you how it's looking and then we can change that situation. But first... I need to make my bed. After making my bed, I need to drink that cold cock. And then I will see you in the living room when I show you how that space looks A like. Good sign, maybe something new. Some good times, give me any clue. Cause I don't want to be left over. I just want to know how it feels to have closure. Tough times I've been going through. Some tough times yeah. I've been going through. I feel like something's missing. My life's a little dull. Think I have a condition. Everything I do, I just feel like I'm existing. I'm in a bad mood and there ain't no point resisting. My mind is on a mission to make me feel different. I don't want to listen, but it's hard when it's persistent. Darkness is gripping, quicksand sifting. I've been sinking into this pit for a minute. Guys, did you see how easy it was to spread my bed? It's because I only slept on this side. And when I sleep, I don't move. I just sleep in one position. So it was just like bringing that back. And that was it. So let's head to the living room. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my living room. But I need cable management to start with. This I have Kozapa Tutanguka. And then I have this mirror over here. I have not yet changed. I have a mirror over here. This is the laundry I did yesterday. I have not even folded this laundry. You see? I have not folded this laundry. I'll fold that. And then look at that situation over there. Those are my throw pillows. The ladder is there. That corner. <laughs> so um, I need to fold those. And then this one, I painted my TV stand yesterday because it was looking so dirty. So I painted, I painted that. It was sour. But this scenario here, gosh, I need help. And then look at that corner. I have all my wall hangings hanging there. This nini is just hanging the way it wants. And then that's like the nini. I, I really am contemplating, guys, between this mirror and the other mirror. Which one should I keep? This mirror and this mirror. I don't know. I don't. But this one, I wanted to cut it. This the big one. This one, I wanted to cut it into a round mirror. This one to maintain it. But I don't know where to place this one. Please comment in the comment section what where you think I should place this one. Cause I really like this one in my background when I'm shooting my reels. But now I don't have a background. And then, this is my wall of curtains. By curtains, I mean sheer on sheer. Cause that is what we are doing in this living room. <laughs> and then that's my 
my coffee table that needs to be to be put in place look at where it is look at the top this is why i'm saying my living room is not livable and then look at this the couch is dirty the couch is dirty look at that corner hey i'm feeling so bad <laughs> looking at it so this is the other couch and then this is the door my doorway i need to paint this you see i in me i painted over it i have black paint so i'll go over it so these are the pro projects for today so look at that i need to paint that to repaint all that and then i still have this sage curtain over here and then this corner i do not even know what i want to do with it i do not even know what i want to do with this area what will i do with this area for god's sake because i know my dining will come here and remember i didn't move out with my other dining it was too big i sold it actually i think i told you already so i i put this one here because i have to study so i need something to sit on while studying right so i still need to buy a chair because i can't sit on the poof so this clothes definitely will go out of there the art will eventually be hanged this table i'm using it to, to read or go to, to attend school and then that uh, definitely i don't know where i'm going to put that this one obviously will be spread this one will leave that space so i have space so i'm thinking eventually once i have settled in well that might be maybe six months because i told you guys i'm not doing makeovers in this house so i'm planning to buy a dining set i'm going to buy a four-seater dining set one that doesn't have huge uh, chairs whereby they occupy a lot of space because now it's just me i would have actually made around a coffee table no around a nini but the space will not allow me to have around dining so i'll just have a square dining with four seats but it must be tiny enough to be in this area and then on the other side i'll have a buffet table whereby after i cut this mirror into a circular one it will go on top of the on top there there will be a circular mirror there the buffet table there and then my dining here and that will be it nothing more in the dining area and then my couch will maintain i will have art there i'm contemplating if i should have three arts i'm just to the way ahead but i have to change the art definitely and then i have to sort out this mess all these are my throw blankets i'm telling you i have lots and lots of throw blankets when i say it it looks weird but yeah here you see zote zote ndio hizo hapo i think kuna mbili ziko kwa hangle ndio nimeosha and then ndio hiyo nyingine iko hapo imehang to it's just chilling with the big boys eh so this is my space for now the living room is not tiny tiny cuz i the other living room when i measured is uh, exact measurements uh, with the other uh, with the other living room the only difference is the other living room it had an open plan kitchen whereby like you thought uh, you saw I might looked like it was extending to the other side but this one is an enclosed kitchen that's why it's looking like this but space is the same if i came with the other dining set maybe i would have placed it on the other side against the window but i think this time i'll put it here so as i've mentioned i have a buffet table over there a tiny one maybe three feet high but a hundred going to that side a uh, hundred width and then a mirror and then the t the table and the chairs over here so these puffs, I will do something with them, but not now. I'll do something with these puffs, but not now. So, and then my floors, I need to mop again because when I was being moved, I think what will go again, I've turned everything, so I need to mop. So what I'm doing in this living room basically is just washing my couch, washing the floors, making sure everything is in place. And that's it because somebody might say it's livable but for me it's not livable because i can't be having things just everywhere as if i'm sick or something you know so i will make it livable repaint that and then directly into my nini hallway i painted over this door because i knew i was going to paint it black so i think today because i'm so tired already and i don't want to do so much to commit to so much this one eventually will live there it's just there because that's my tools when i need maybe a brush or something i just get it real quick but when i'm done with the painting and everything nothing will be there so i need to paint the frame i paint the frame only and then they don't paint bad eye because i'm so tired i'm so tired so it's going to be black like my bedroom door and guys if you peep through that mirror that one can you see my bedroom can you see my bedroom there can you see my bedroom because that light damn i want that same light in the living room and it can't be coming in because of how messy things are so let's get down to business i'll talk too much we say the heart wants what it wants, right? So here is my cock. <laughs> Ice cock on the rocks. <laughs> ah, 
with this cube so msianza kusema tio mdemo wao umeanza kutumia madawa na it's coca cola in my christmas wine glass and a straw as we work guys i have changed my outfit i'm wearing a, a pair of tights i don't know if you can see i'm wearing a pair of tights and this uh, meshy vest and is it a boob top or a boob top should be a book talk, right? <laughs> I'm thinking a white one. So this is the look of the day. And this is my cold Coca-Cola. Who drinks soda in the morning? Mm -mm. Lucy and Nell. If they watch this video, somebody tell them that I, I, I see them drinking Fanta Orange in the morning. So I'm joining them with my cock. solution for me because my nini is white my couch is white i opt for vinegar baking soda little bit of jig and then i only add omo because i want not omo it's that powder i use in my washing machine it has some certain scent and it lasts longer on my seats or my couch and that's why i add it to my water so it's time to go in and start like anywhere and everywhere we go in today i'm using this one I've been looking for the white mini but I've not seen my white towel I've not seen so I'm going to use this one I have already cleaned the two couches, this one and the two seater and I want to show you the water. Look at that guys. Look at that. So you can't always say that your couch is clean. I've cleaned that and uh, if you see any spots or whatever, just know it, uh, it is here to dry. So in the meantime, oh and also guys, see I broke my nail. I broke my pinky and these are just my natural nails imagine if I had gone in and put tips when I knew it was moving to it will really be bad because now I've lost this one so I will wait for the couch to dry for a little bit and as that happens I'm going to tackle that door I'm going to paint that door because it really looks really bad so I'm going in with the black paint on the door wherever so that it can go back to how it was
guys this is my washroom haki washroom bathroom confuses me which is which guys somebody by the abuni elimisha poa comment section washroom bathroom huh the english is refusing so as you can see when you were painting your roller is going to end everywhere so but i left it like that i didn't work because i knew i was going in with black paint and because i do not have enough black paint over here i'm just going to to paint the frame of it and i'm using a makeup brush the reason why i'm using a makeup brush on the with the black is because i don't want too much spillage you see how it was easier to paint the the front door that the, without any spillage or Wenda on the other side that's why i decided i'm using this brush so i'm going to go all around the framework with the black and then ikibaki it's when i paint only this side and then when i buy other paint i can paint on the inside but i don't want to also paint on the inside of the bathroom bathroom washroom because i'm thinking i want a theme in each of the rooms you know and this theme might cause in the living room in the bedroom is just white and black and that's it like minimal black but more of the white and then in the bathroom i'm thinking of sage green but i don't know how that will look sage green and a touch of wood i don't know we will see so let me paint the black here because this is just a direct reflection to the living room so i want like that cohesion from this to this i want them to be like this so let's i've been waking up alone you left me here hours ago obsessively check my phone do you even know pick apart your every word push it down like i'm unconcerned i've been damaged and it shows when the can you tell Guys, look at that. I'm gonna move back, but Nadia kuna vitu mingi, but concentrate on what I'm saying. <laughs> look at that door. Really looks amazing, and that's why I was insisting I wanted to paint it black so that I can have a nice flow from the living room to the hallway. So that's how it's looking. Looks really amazing, and I feel like it's it now matches the vibe of the living room, and I love it. I love it hundred percent. Look at that. I think it it looks really amazing, and I'm thinking moving forward when I get a new coffee table because I'm going to make one, but not now. I will make a black one so that I can have like that a uh, black and white touch run through the house, especially in the open spaces, the bedroom, the living room, and kitchen. But kitchen, I'm here to figure out a few things. That's why like I'm not even going to show you anything. But you can see me a few times cooking and everything. But I want to get money and sort out my storage situation in there. So I like the color of that door. Looks really amazing. And it it's actually blending with the living room and I love it. and i think it's time uh, it's time i decide what i want to wear and how and that is where i'm having a problem because i just know this area has to be maintained for my dining area when it comes in and i don't want to disarrange far from what i have now because that might not work when the dining is here i want to have this space here so that i can always know that my dining should be going here because this is the closest area to the kitchen but okay the main thing that is disturbing me or my disturbing my brain is i have two mirrors now in the living room i don't want to move this mirror i don't know if you understand i don't want to move this mirror and I still want that mirror in a corner because this house has only two corners, that corner and this corner. And I can't have that set up in this corner because this is where my dining will be. So I don't know, what should I do? 
what should I do because I'm stuck. I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck. I mean, I should just start putting things together and then see where I head with that because if I stand here and think of where I want what, this vlog is not going to be done. So let me bring in the plant. agree guys should i move the mirror am i should move the plant should i interchange mirror and plant am i should let it stay like that that's what is disturbing me that is what is disturbing me kabisa kabisa because i don't know should i move the plant should i move the mirror because i'm feeling maybe i should interchange so that the mirror has a but what will that look like in all honesty think about it Wiping the mirror, maybe you can see better. You can reason clearly. <laughs> I don't know. Oh God, what do I do? What do I do? Or maybe let's work with this and then we'll just get back to it, right? If it doesn't work, we can always come back to it, right? So that we don't waste time there. See, the sun is almost here so i'm standing here uh, uh, in the entryway and i want to show you i've decided to move this lamp on this side because i felt like this area was being crowded so i moved it to that area so it shall stay there until further notice also this one i'm still contemplating if i should move it so for now it's going to stay here but i'll move it later when i have decided where it goes so this is the other coach that's where my dining should be and then that mirror please don't question me about that mirror i know i have two mirrors in the living room it's not even aesthetically pleasing but that mirror i do not want to go and cut it before i get my dining because my dining table will determine how big i want the mirror to be so i have two of them in the living room and i know i know it's not pleasing to have to look like that and then this is the nini area the curtain area the curtain wall and i interchanged my share i hope i've told you and then this is the other couch and i like this beige in this house looks really amazing this is my area rug it's bigger i think i need a smaller one Ama, somebody tell me in the comment section i feel like it's too big i'm a sijui maybe in my organization in Mekata, but we'll see so this is how this area is looking like my table is here it's so far from the other seat but i realize i only sit on the three seater because it's easier and it's uh, comfy and enjoyable than the two seater unless i have guests i don't sit on that so watch i make a carbon three seater my tv over there that's how i made that area to look like 
added my bicycle there because I, I don't have an entryway table and I'm not going to get one. And then uh, I have my nini there, my tree there, my, my tree, my plant over there. So I'm thinking I should move this plant to the farthest corner and then bring the mirror this area. That's what is in my head, but we will just see. But I love that vibe when you look through the mirror, you see my, what's, what's the name? The ladder, the ladder holding my throws and looks so good. I don't know if I should start on top with white, then brown, then black armor. I feel like it's weird to start with black, brown, and me. I will see, I will see. So this area looks really amazing, but the mirror, this area is what is frustrating me. I'm trying to see how I can balance it out so that it doesn't look overwhelming. Because I feel like my eye is so, I can't tell where the error is, but I just know like there's something that should be done. Somebody in the comment section tell me what I should do with that area. And then the smaller one this is not like a tour i'm just like showing you what i've done because i don't think i'm even doing a tour unless otherwise if you request maybe so this is the area the mirror i've said i know it's a mess over there because one thing maybe i will bring the mirror here but i don't want because i feel like it will be reflecting on the other side and then there's something that is off about that that's why i'm not bringing it here because if i bring it here it means this table needs to go there and i don't want that wall to have so much going on so this table is going to be here because i'm going to be studying from here until i get my dining table and then this lamp is over here i've already mentioned that and i need to hang the art and that is the next task and i'm so tired i don't know if i can do it now so guys, this is my living room. It's looking livable until further notice because I know there are a few things that I need to change here and there. But this is what I have that I can live in and feel at home. So I put this plant here even though I don't feel it. I have my two puffs over there. I think I will change the fabric. And then I hang the art but one is up, one is down. <laughs> I will sort out that because I have to swap out the art too. And then this one is frustrating my head. I don't know what should I think. Because I feel like it's making that area crowded. And I don't have any alternative. So I'm trying to see where it will go. But for now let it stay there. And then I have that kawaii truck over there. And then this corner is still on top of my mind. But we will figure it out. And then I think this is everything. And I feel like this space is livable. And I feel like over time maybe I'll be switching up things. But this is like livable. This looks like I just moved from the other house and carried everything. And put it the way it was. And I feel like it's it's a vibe in its own. Wake up, no sunlight. So cold, sleep's nice. So tired, my eyes fight. They just want to close back up tight get up put on hard work at the crack of dawn this life ain't for the weak ones no this life pure only for the strong feeling slow shake it off don't got time for negative thoughts red sight got the dot to my shot i want the i think uh, we've come to the end of this episode and i don't feel like it was a moving in vlog but it felt like a reset vlog so i feel like whatever wherever we are with the house i feel like it's livable i can live here until i feel like switching up things and i know outside it looks like it's going to rain so i want to prepare some porridge and just enjoy and watch at least uh, netflix and just like chill as i do a diy that i want to do but i'm doing that or should i show you i will start a clip if i have to show you so um, do like a little diy as i drink porridge and then i figure out what i want to have for dinner also i think nothing more nothing has changed really in this space because most of these things i have had them for the longest time possible and this is why they say when you're buying things for your house buy things that are timeless and by timeless maybe if you move to from your apartment to the next one you don't have to go break a bank for you to make things happen so as you've seen these things that are that are in this house i've had them and i'm actually like feeling better yesterday I had a little bit of a migraine but today i'm feeling okay and i think i can push and do that diy and then uh, watch a movie i don't want to say it so that i jinx it beforehand so i won't say it i'll skip it <laughs> but this is everything so if you have not subscribed to this channel i don't know what you're waiting for please go ahead and subscribe if you have not if you have never commented in any of my videos this is your time to comment please go ahead and comment on this video also guys advise me about that corner that has the mirror and the plant i, I will actually wait for you guys to tell me before interchange because i'm feeling like there's something that is wrong there but i can't like you know you know something is wrong but you can't place 
you can't place it i don't know what is wrong on that side so um, this is everything and i think i will see you on my next video from me sweetest peace and i'm out bye guys Thank you.